Here's an example of an A minor pentatonic, root six, basic form. There's my root. Play this back and forth using all down picks 12 times perfectly before moving on. Now I'm going to expand this. Moving that note down, and these two notes up. This is still my root. I use first and third fingers. Here's an example. Play this back and forth 12 times perfectly before moving on. my root. Here's an A minor pentatonic root 5 basic form on the 12th fret. This is just like the A minor pentatonic in the open form, except since I can use all of my fingers, I don't have the obstacle of this first fret being played instead of an open string. So again, here's my A minor pentatonic, root five, basic form. Here's my root. Using all down picks, play this back and forth perfectly 12 times before moving on. your root. Now here's an A minor pentatonic root 5 expanded using first and third fingers. Play this back and forth using all down picks 12 times perfectly before moving on. Here's your example. your root. Here's an example of an A minor pentatonic root 5 in the open position. Now when we're in the key of E the open position is an excellent choice. But when you're in the key of A you need to be aware that this first fret right here on the B string is where the note is played. We do not have an open string there. So I find this to be just a little bit awkward, but it can definitely be used. But just be aware of this. Now, because the majority of the strings are open, I'm going to use my first and second fingers. And for this note, I use my first and then third fingers on my B string. So I'll be shifting back and forth just a little bit. Let me show you. My A string open is where my root is. Now, with this being open, and with the B string with this note being here, expanding this, obviously we can't go down, but expanding this upward, that's definitely a possibility. So here's an A minor pentatonic, root five, expanded form. Here's your example. Play this back and forth 12 times, perfectly before moving on.